Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to review the book Meditations, Creative Visualization and Meditation Exercises to Enrich Your Life, by Shakti Gawain. This book, written by Shakti Gawain, is an excellent guide for anyone interested in practicing creative visualization and meditation. Shakti Gawain is a well-known author and teacher in the field of personal development, and her expertise is evident in the clear and concise way that she presents her ideas. The book is divided into two parts. The first part focuses on creative visualization, which is the process of using your imagination to create a mental image of what you want to achieve or experience. The second part focuses on meditation, which is the practice of quieting the mind and focusing on the present moment. One of the things I appreciate about this book is that it provides a wide range of exercises and techniques to suit different preferences and needs. For example, there are guided visualizations that are helpful for beginners, as well as more advanced techniques for experienced practitioners. Another thing I like about this book is that it emphasizes the importance of trusting your intuition and following your own path. While there are many techniques presented in the book, Gawain encourages readers to experiment and find what works best for them. Overall, I highly recommend, Meditations, Creative Visualization and Meditation Exercises to Enrich Your Life, to anyone interested in exploring the power of their mind and enhancing their life through visualization and meditation. It's a practical and inspiring guide that is sure to help readers develop their own unique practice. That's it for my review of, Meditations, Creative Visualization and Meditation Exercises to Enrich Your Life, by Shakti Gawain. If you've read this book, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you found this review helpful, Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more book reviews and other content. Thanks for watching.